Hey everyone, welcome to the CompTIA A Plus course introduction and overview. Like the title states, this short video is to give you an overview of what the course is about and what you can expect in the videos to come from this series. If you're new to my channel guys, hi, I'm Warren. Remember to give me a like down below and also to subscribe perhaps, otherwise you're not going to know when the next video for this series comes out. Just mentioning it. So with regards to the CompTIA A Plus course, I've got more than 10 years of experience. That's a decade, more than a decade's experience when it comes to training this course. I also have a lot of experience when it comes to being in the actual field itself. All of that I can pass on to you guys. So yeah, you're in good hands. With regards to the actual course itself, guys, I will be covering the full A Plus course, which consists of 18 modules, in case you didn't know. I will be covering both the core one and core two for those of you that's not familiar with those terms. The full course obviously covers both, both core one and core two. The course I deliver will be enough for someone to be able to pass the A plus international certification exams. So if you're someone looking to go and write one of those A plus exams, most likely both of them, this is the right place. There should be more than enough to be able to pass those exams. Uh, this course I deliver can be used by people that already know most of these things, but just want to, you know, brush up on the things here and there that they've forgotten, perhaps. This course should be able to help those that need to troubleshoot a personal technical issue, or perhaps a technical issue at the workplace, perhaps, you never know. At the end of this course, after covering the last module, I'll be making a dedicated video specifically giving exam tips for the CompTIA A plus exams. I want to make it clear though, that I will absolutely not be giving out brain dumps. Those are very unethical and very frowned upon in the IT community. Most vendors, quite frankly, don't allow those. You can basically call them illegal. And if you're caught using those, you can actually be stripped of all of your qualifications, your certifications, and be prevented from writing any exams in the future again. So that is not something anyone wants. So I do not encourage you guys to use anything like that. Then lastly, guys, for your convenience, I will be adding timestamps in the video description of each video in this series. These can be used to very quickly and very easily find a specific topic in a video. So like I said, some of these videos could be quite lengthy. I mean, we are covering the whole A plus course after all, and some of these modules are quite large. So for you to find a specific topic, you know, to go and skim, skim, skim is gonna take you forever in a day. So if you're someone that just wants to find a specific topic perhaps, this can save you a tremendous amount of time. Or if you're someone that's already watched a particular video and you wanna go back and recover a specific topic that you've forgotten perhaps, or you just wanna go and freshen up on it, this is gonna save you a tremendous amount of time to find that topic you're looking for. Just look in the description, look for the timestamp, click on the timestamp, and it's gonna take you straight to that point in the video, saving you a tremendous amount of time. Well guys, that's pretty much it for the intro of this course. All that's left to say is break that like button down below and subscribe to be able to follow this A plus series. I mean, it doesn't help you want to follow this and you're not subscribed. You're not going to know when the actual episode comes out. If anyone has any questions about this series, something A plus exam related, you know, or maybe topic related about something in this course, you're more than welcome to drop a comment down below and I will gladly get back to you as soon as I possibly can. All right, guys, so that is the intro. I will see you in module one of A+. Keep an eye out for it.